Hi everyone, this is a packing video for a Jujube Hobo Bee. This is the Jujube and Whimsical Whisper, which is one of my favorite all-time prints. It is so feminine and girly. I love it. So this is right up my alley. I have a diaper bag that's also like a purse because I love to collect purses. And it's just perfect. This is an ideal bag for almost any purpose. In the front tuck pocket is where I would put my phone if I wasn't using it to record this video. In the mommy pocket, well, let me take this out first. This is a 17 ounce swell bottle. It fits in there pretty well. In the mommy pocket, I keep a medium set piece, also in Whimsical Whisper. This I keep my necessities in that go from bag to bag. So I just have some lotion, chapstick, a clip, and a pen in there. And I always stick this uh, small set piece in there as well. In the small set piece, I have just some little essentials, hair ties for my daughter and I. I have a liner, some Vaseline, some super glue, eye drops. These two pieces go with me whether I'm going to a purse or a diaper bag or a bigger diaper bag or a pump bag. This always comes with me. Also in the mommy pocket, I keep a uh, coin purse in Whimsical Whisper as my wallet in a hobo bee. There's just not a lot of room in a hobo bee. Inside of the front zipper of the hobo bee, inside the mommy pocket, I keep my um, Spyderco knife. I end up using knives for so many different tools. I think they're great to carry with you and if you ever need it for self-defense, it's a good thing to have. In the main pocket, I keep a medium set piece. No, I'm sorry, this is the large set piece. It has toys in it for my 10 month old. Keep him entertained on the go. And then I use a fuel cell inside of this particular uh, hobo bee, but I usually use a bee quick. But we are a cloth diapering family, so I keep my cloth goods in here. I keep a booty pod, which is not as good as a wipe pouch, but it gets the job done. I've had these wipes in here for like two months and they're still moist, so. They work great. I always keep bamboo inserts in the pocket diapers that I carry for on the go because they're just thinner. And then of course I have an ointment. This is Burt's Bees multi-purpose ointment and it's great for cloth diapers and regular diapers and if you have a little skin irritation, lips, whatever, it's a great, great ointment to use. Alternatively, I use my fuel cell to carry my milk when I pump, which I have the same pump bag and whimsical whisper also. I don't really keep much else in this pocket. I do keep some hand sanitizer and tissues in one of them, but I don't like to fill up the pockets because I like the ability to grab my pieces and change to another bag at the drop of a dime. In the very back pocket, I keep a disposable diaper in case I don't feel like doing cloth, and I keep a tiny tiny wet bag because if I am going out of the house I only need a small wet bag if I'm taking the hobo bee. If I'm going to be gone longer I don't take my hobo bee while my baby's still so young and goes through so many diapers. Now on this bag I actually keep the strap from my bee supplied um, because it's just better. It's longer. Hobo bees are meant to be a hobo style bag, which is over the shoulder. They weren't really meant to be crossbody, but I like the crossbody option because diaper bags can get super heavy. So let me just stick all this stuff back in here really quick. I'm really excited for my bee quick to come in the mail because it works so much better in hobo bees. I have a hobo bee in black and bloom and black magic. I just love this style of purse. Especially right now with Corona, you never know when you're going to want to wash your bag. Or your coins. Coin pouch, that is. Alright, so if you have any other questions, let me know in the comments, as always. And have a good rest of your day.